vlog day 350 Back to Versailles. It's Saturday. I keep forgetting that I don't know what day of the week it is most of the time anymore. But that explains why it's so nice and quiet this morning. There's pretty much no one on the train. Really quiet here. I mean, mornings are really quiet in France no matter what you do, but I completely forgot why this morning was especially quiet. So, off to the Versailles. Have a nice morning picnic and back. I'm sure it'll be lovely. Wheel. Oh, I already got something on my hands. I gotta go buy some supplementary passes really quick for some people that don't have the right tickets. Do that and then run back. Hopefully I'll have time to get some food. I have yet to eat anything today, so that'd be a good idea. Just an interesting start to the morning. Hit the everything that, oh, so. We just have had a couple of hiccups along the way, so good adventures to start the morning. Makes it interesting. Thankfully the group seems really cool. They all seem to be rolling with the punches really well, so. This is just one of those days where kind of all the random little annoyances that can happen do happen. You just gotta kind of deal with it. For example, uh, the first train station we went to, turnstiles were broken. So we had to go to another one. Just little things here and there. Like we set up, we were parking our bikes and some guy came and was like, uh, I'm gonna set up my stand here soon, so don't park your bikes here. Uh, so we had to move those. Just little things like that. I don't know why this guy's in the bike lane. It's a handicap spot. Pretty sure he's not handicapped, but you know, whatever. Anyways, let's go buy some tickets and then rush back. As another example, they're only taking cards, not cash, here at the booth, which closes before I can get my group here, so, uh, 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 uh. I got cash from them, thankfully, but I'll have to give them their cash back and then we'll, we'll figure it out, one way or another. Uh, yeah, it's one of those days. That was close, because I don't know the pin for my card yet. So I almost wasn't able to pay because I only have my French card on me. But thankfully, it had contactless payment. So I was able to pay without my pin. Oh, that was close. Anyways, I think I just drained a little was in that account. And uh, now we have tickets, so that's good. So I'll give those tickets back to them. But I think I'm gonna have time to eat something. Whew, crisis averted, because otherwise the only way place to get tickets like that is at the main entrance, and that is a zoo right now. All right. A uh, very quick espresso, and then off we go. Jeez, look at the size of those horns. That guy is like a, that is a devil goat right there. That is a legit devil goat. Look at him. He he fits he fits into a pentagram. Oh wow, that guy too. Yeah, devil goat. A little bit of Kareem's fresh squeezed orange juice stuff is so good. This is going really well. In spite of the fact that we've had a couple of hiccups to start, everybody in this group has actually been really, really cool. We haven't stressed out at all. Just kind of made it up as we went along. Got through a couple of hangups, roadblocks, but it's gone super smooth. So I have sent them to look at something cool. While they're looking at something cool, I'm standing here in the shade enjoying some orange juice. That's about the summary of that. It's pretty crazy to think that we're, th we're within 10 days of hitting the full year mark. It's almost a week, actually. We're almost a week away, which is insanity. I have a lot of stuff coming up. I have a lot of work to do. I'm trying to figure out how to balance it all because I've done a pretty bad job of getting some of those side projects done while I've been getting used to the tour guiding thing. And when you're out in the sun all day, it's a little bit tiring, but I think I'm about to get on top of it, so. This part, both the riding and the lunch. Lunch is to follow. Lunch might be my favorite part. The weather is wonderful. I feel like I'm acclimating to the heat and the sun. And these guys are all good sports. So we're gonna take the long route. We're gonna go up to the top of the canal and uh, then have a picnic over on the other side in the shade. Should be glorious. Well, 
voila, day is done. We did have a fruit explosion at the end that had to be cleaned up, but aside from that, all good. Not a bad day out in Versailles. It was actually really, really nice out. The weather, I think I'm acclimating to the heat a little bit. I'm sweating a lot, but I'm not uncomfortable with it, so that's good. All those years living on the equator have to come in good for something at some point. So I'm gonna eat something, and then I'm gonna head out and meet friends on the river, including two of the people on my tour who I think are gonna join us. But either way, you're gonna go spend time down on the river, and that'll be really nice. I also think I might need to make myself some shorts. We do that here, hold on. Um, maybe we'll keep where them where they're torn. Maybe that's where we'll go. Uh, I've never really made shorts before. These are like my favorite pair of pants. They're super comfortable. Obviously, you've seen them all over the vlog. Till recently, because the tear in the knees makes them a little bit dangerous. But they also could be. They could have a second life as a pair of shorts. Oy. This is the real test here. Oh, maybe we should keep that for authenticity's sake. Boom. Oh, that feels so short. I hope that's not too short. Okay, where is this one? Right here. Boom. Shorts. Ooh, so free. So comfy. I'm really scared. Well, any suggestions what I should do with this stuff? If you have any good ideas, I'll, keep, I'll hold on to it for a little bit. Leave it in the comments below if you think there's something I can do with these. Anyways, we've made shorts. Oh, that was bad. Sort of ended up on my hard drives. And my GoPro might have gone over the edge. Mm -hmm. 